Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you or anybody can get a Russian IP address irrespective of where you live. Okay, so I'm going to show you how um, you can change your IP address to any country. In this one I'm going to show you how you can change it to Russia. Um, at the moment I'm in the UK and if I whiz up to this um, website called um, whatismycountry.com you can see it uses um, geolocation and it's looked up the um, country of uh, my IP address which as you can see is the UK and it's actually gone fairly close to where I am so it's picked Liverpool not quite right but that's um, my ISP where I'm connecting from so um, I'm going to show you how we can change IP address and basically take control of it it's very useful if you want to connect to different websites if you want to you can buy stuff cheap from different things like Steam um, or if you just want to keep a level of anonymity to your browsing and um, keep your real location hidden um, Russian IP address is quite a good one for anonymity because you're rooted through a Russian server so let me just close this um, screen here and show you the program that I use um, now you can pay loads of money for a, a dedicated IP address but um, for most people using a VPN service is more than sufficient they're highly secure and they keep no logs so if you're worried about anonymity there are no logs kept at all on any of these servers so you can basically do what you like and um, there's nothing recorded there uh, I'm going to show you um, here, you can see there's a list of all the different servers, it just sits in your taskbar here. You can set it up manually if uh, you want to use it on a uh, tablet or a um, smartphone or something like that. But um, if you're using a PC or a laptop or something, it's, it's easier to use the software. <coughs> Excuse me. So you can see there's lots of different servers here all over the world. Um, for instance, loads of UK ones. I use these for things like the BBC and ITV because they're kind of restricted. Big media sites restrict to domestic markets. So if you want to watch things like Hulu, change to a US server, <coughs> um, and, and so on. There's loads of different countries here. But I'm going to show you the Russian one, as I said. So without waffling on, let me just find the Russian servers. There's a lot of servers here. Ah, here we go. Uh, these are a selection of servers. Identicloak uh, has Russian servers in Moscow. Um, some of the other VPNs have um, servers in St. Petersburg as well, I think. But um, Identicloak has just got Moscow servers. But if that's important to you. So I double click on here. So what I'm going to do is make sure I'm connected to a Russian server. I'm going to tell here I normally... I'm kind of paranoid so I have my um, VPN switch countries and locations I'm going to turn that off now so we'll stay connected to a Russian server uh, I've just blurred that out because obviously the IP addresses are best if they're kept um, secret to subscribers so let's just close that down here so basically now I've got a um, Russian IP address let me just go show you now um, we we'll go to uh, oh, let me just start this browser again so it picks up the change uh, let me just go to Google and you can see I don't know if you can notice here but I've gone to it's redirected me to the Russian version of Google because Google detects what IP address we've got it sees I've got a Russian IP address now let's go to what is my country and here we can see you remember before I'm actually in the, the USA but um, what's my country is now reporting that I'm in the Russian Federation so every single website I visit will see the IP address of Russia they will think I am in Russia they don't see anything about me basically um, so yeah I've got a Russian IP address that's all it is to it I'm gonna finish now because um, to keep this video short so that's how you use it. Um, uh, I use Identicloak uh, if you want a Russian IP address. They've got some fast servers in Moscow. Not a lot of people use them actually. Um, so you'll find they're, they're super fast as well. Um, and if you want to access Russian only stuff as well, you can use the Russian IP address. Um, there's uh, a, a code below, a discount code, if you want to try it out. Um, and there's one in the top right hand screen there as well. 
okay thanks very much for watching and bye for now